Good evening guys and happy Tuesday to all of your sunshiny faces. Well guys, I actually, today, I got every single thing checked off my planner, which is awesome. Um, although I didn't do it all myself, I had help today because I am um, not, not thriving right now. <laughs> um, I don't know what happened, but last night when I was sitting at my desk, I was like editing. And I don't know if it was because of the way like I wasn't like positioned completely straight in front of my computer. So I kept like kind of turning over weird to like my desk to like, you know, like on my Mac um, to try and edit yesterday. And so um, like, you know, I don't know, the way I kept spinning was kind of weird, like while I was editing. And then all of a sudden nothing happened that was like, oh my gosh, I pulled something or, you know, I did something to my back or whatever. Um, but like it slowly started to bother me. And at first I kind of just thought, oh, it was like I was just sitting weird, you know, so like I kind of you know moved a little bit and like it didn't bother me that much anymore and then it happens kind of again um like you know where I noticed that I something was up sort of with like my lower back <laughs> and then um I was like okay well, you know again to kind of moved again it kind of went away then it was weird like after I got done taking a shower all of a sudden it was just it was hurting so bad I had like pain all the way down the back of my leg all the way up it was like up over my shoulder and like into my neck it was not very good so um originally i was like tuesday though was the only day we were planning on going walking today because it was supposed to be a little bit nicer today and it's supposed to be really cold like almost every other day this week other than tuesday which was today was supposed to not even be over 40 degrees i actually think maybe thursday will be 40 for a high but every other day it's going to be like 36 or you know something like that i'm not trying to be outside while it's you know like again too in the morning it'll probably be like you know 25 degrees out um when we go walking because like today again too it was supposed to be 55 but i think it was actually 39 when we went walking or maybe about 40 degrees actually um so it was like still a 15 degree difference of what the highest temperature for today was supposed to be and i think it did get up to 55 but it was not when we were going like walking this morning so anyways though i ended up like i said finally fell asleep last night because i couldn't because i just couldn't get comfortable so i fell asleep and then ended up waking up in the morning and actually felt felt fine. I was just like, okay, you know, it was just a little tweak or like, you know, again, whatever, you know, tweaked my back, you know, something like that. I don't know. It wasn't, again, too, it wasn't like I did something and immediately was like, oh my gosh, like, you know, um, and like I was picking stuff up or whatever. And, you know, like I just, I ended up noticing it. It was really weird that it was like at, while I was at my desk and it was like kind of coming and going and like wasn't real noticeable. But then I was like, of course, like once I was taking a shower and then like done taking a shower and was going to bed, then all of a sudden it was like, I just couldn't get comfortable. So again, too, though, when I woke up this morning, I didn't notice anything and it wasn't bothering me. And I honestly kind of forgot about it a little bit. And so I was like, okay, well, like, you know, we'll go walking. And um, we did. It was cold out. I don't think it was as cold, though, as that one day where I told you guys it was the day after when it was like 80 degrees. And then the next day was like 40 something degrees or 50 or something like that. And it was windy and really overcast. Today was really windy probably the windiest day it's been that we've been walking but it wasn't actually surprisingly that cold like I wasn't really that bundled up for today and I also wasn't freezing cold like the wind would be like cold on the one side like where it was blowing from but like it wasn't actually like that bad um and like Jack was saying he was like oh my gosh I was freezing but to me the other day when it was like colder and windier and more overcast was worse and maybe it's just because the day before was so hot and then like the following day was so freezing cold that it was more noticeable but like today like again too the wind like it didn't have that like oh my gosh like it's stinging like it's so cold and the wind is blowing so hard that like, like where any exposed skin was like stinging from the wind and the cold it didn't feel like that today surprisingly so we ended up again too going on our whole walk and like every Thing, and I felt good afterwards too. Um, and then by like midday today, it kind of started up again. No clue what I was doing. I wasn't like lifting things again or like moving stuff around. The only thing I can think of was that I was moving all those pictures on Sunday um, from the living room into the back bedroom. So that again too, like while we were doing St. Patrick's Day and everything like that, like they weren't just out in the living room. So I ended up moving those. I moved them all by myself. And you know, again too, I mean, they were a handful of 
boxes and it was heavy and it took me a, several trips to get through. Um, but again, too, it, it wasn't all that horrible. So, um, and I didn't notice anything on Sunday, but then I was like, could that have just been a combination of like doing that? And then again, too, maybe I just did tweak it yesterday, like while I was sitting kind of like so weird at my desk. And then it was just like a combination of like the two things kind of happening very close together and like again too maybe I aggravated my back somewhat on Sunday and then just really did like something weird like yesterday night um but again too it was just weird that it like kind of came out of nowhere it was like I was just sitting there <laughs> and then all of a sudden I was like oh my back and then like it was like that for most of the day like the end of the day today I feel much better like I did this morning and like earlier today it feels better too I was putting icy hot on I was like I also tried to do a lot of stretches that I felt like were really good for like again to lower back because I love yoga and I haven't done yoga in a really long time but I was trying to do like some of that a little bit without like doing anything where I was like yeah that's gonna like irritate it more but I feel like it helped like stretch it out and it felt a lot better and like I said to doing other stuff like putting on icy hot I took an ibuprofen I did ice it too probably been the worst as far as like I couldn't really do a whole lot and like I was very scared to do anything because I didn't want to make it worse um whereas again too it's like when I if something's up with my neck or something like that it's just like oh my gosh like it's annoying but you know I never feel like I'm gonna aggravate it worse really I mean I sort of do but like I don't know with my back it feels like it's scarier <laughs> that it will be worse and like I won't be able to literally move at all and whereas my neck I'm like okay well like it's kind of annoying or whatever with my neck I'm just like I know that I could irritate it worse but like I won't be like incapacitated and won't be able to move or something like that um whereas my back I feel much more scared especially like my lower back where I'm just going to be like I can't move like it that that's literally like you know my neck it's like okay I just like can't move like this way or something like that my back is like I literally might not be able to walk <laughs> like if my back ends up like completely going out which has never happened to me but my dad has really really bad like back especially lower back like he that's happened to him and so I never want to get to that point so that is why I'm especially to like walking like that kind of stuff just things to keep you more active and like that's why too I want to implement more of the yoga into my daily workout routine where I'm also doing my walking every day too and like that kind of stuff whereas again I told you guys so today was going to be the only day that we were going walking because of how cold it was supposed to be the rest of this week so that's it's not really that great but um yeah it's like all of my muscles like in my whole back kind of feel off but there's like one specific spot in my lower back on my left side that's like it that's like the worst part and then I can feel it like I feel like it's probably what's creating the other kind of muscle pains around and stuff like that like in other parts of my back and like I was saying too like even in my shoulder and stuff like that like surprisingly normally if my shoulder like I it's more on this side because I'm right-handed but it's on this side right now I feel like that's probably because it's all the muscles from that side that are irritating me because of that I normally always try and get the bathrooms cleaned on Tuesday so thankfully Jack ended up doing the bathroom the um shower and tub and clean that um and I just ended up doing the things that I could like stand and do so like the sink and like the toilet <laughs> for the most part and like the windows and like glass cleaner all that kind of stuff I did not like get down on my hands and knees cleaning like the basement boards and the floors and all that kind of stuff but anything that I could kind of do standing up and then again too Jack was like a huge help in <laughs> doing the bathroom like the tub and the shower um so like everything still got done so I was like I can still check everything off of my planner for today because I did everything else I did edit and upload today and it felt like sitting at my desk too when I wasn't kind of swiveling around weird like I was doing last night was like good so um and it felt kind of more comfortable than sitting in my bed probably would have had I been like working on stuff but I also ended up doing laundry and I did dishes and I did dishes this morning before everything was like way worse so again too maybe that also made things worse for like a second time um and then also to like laundry so I have no clue but I'm feeling a lot better I just again too don't want to like make things worse or um you know again to like irritate things any worse than they are but the pain down my leg is not as bad 
bad. To be quite honest, I should probably go to a chiropractor. I'm just really scared of chiropractors. Like, the weird thing is, I'm actually, I would be okay if I went and got, like, acupuncture. Like, that to me is not scary, but a chiropractor is scary. Like, I'm not scared of needles, <laughs> which is kind of funny because I used to be terrified of needles as a child. But, like, I don't think that I would be. I actually think acupuncture would be, like, very relaxing. And, again, too, I don't think I would do anything, like, on my face. That's kind of scary. I don't think I, I would like that. But I don't know why, like, going to a chiropractor, though, and getting my back, like, you know, stretched and just, like, you know, them cracking your back and stuff like that, that just seems gross and terrifying to me like cracking my back is like if I'm not the one doing it just seems very scary and like I'm just I'm more scared of that than I would be of getting acupuncture <laughs> like I even told my mom that too I was like you know I wouldn't mind actually going and getting that done but I'm for some reason terrified of the chiropractor and I don't want to go but I feel like I have a lot of back and neck pains it's funny too because I feel like kind of like my parents too, both of them would say it was probably around my age when they started noticing more back and neck pain as well. But I still feel like I'm like, you know, like 15 years old. I'm like, I, I this, this should not be happening to me. Um, but at the same time too, I'm like, I'm not, I'm not definitely not 15 anymore. And I'm, you know, like feeling it now. And again, too, to stay nice and healthy, maybe chiropractor wouldn't be a bad idea, but I'm also like that it's just scary to me. Um, so I, I feel like again, too, other things like acupuncture <laughs> is not as scary to me. And, um, I don't, I, like I said, I don't know why that is. Like, I just, I remember, like, a couple times my parents went to, like, chiropractors when I was, like, really little. I remember, like, going into the room, because, again, too, I was, like, little, like, four or five years old or something like that. And I remember, like, sitting there, like, playing with my toys or whatever in the room. And my parents would be, like, in there getting, like, you know, their backs cracked and stuff like that. And I don't know why, as, like, a little kid, I just thought that, that like, they were, like, I don't know, breaking their backs and necks and stuff like that. And I was, like, I don't, I don't think... I want to do that. I don't think that sounds seems fun to me. Um, you know, I know that it's like it's good for you and it's not scary, but um, at the same time, too, I'm like, I just I don't know. It, it does seem kind of scary at the same time. My dad has a really, really good chiropractor that he goes to, and I was like, I don't know, maybe, but at the same time, I'm also really, really scared, and I don't know. Anyways, as of right now, I am feeling much better, which is good. And again, too, it's nice that I didn't um, have to clean the entire bathroom <laughs> myself because that might have not been good. Also too, like I feel like maybe sometimes cleaning the bathroom and cleaning the shower specifically probably again too is not that great for like again to your back and neck and all that kind of stuff. Again too, it's nice that Jack was able to to get that done for today because I, I, I honestly too, my mom was like, well, you don't have to do it if you don't feel good. And I was like, I just don't want to like leave it. And then it'd be like worse next week when I go to take care of it, you know? or again to like later in the week or something like that but then again too jack was able to take care of it so that was nice that um you know it, it won't be worse now like next week and <laughs> having to take care of it but anyways i'm going to take a shower and get to bed and hopefully that helps a little bit too but anyways i will see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog if you guys did enjoy today's make sure you guys give it a thumbs up if you guys are new i'd love if you'd subscribe and i'll see you all over some shiny faces tomorrow so bye guys